Hey guys, uh, welcome back to the other interesting video. Uh, today uh, we are gonna see uh, the interesting topic which is going to be useful for again a 3D print. So uh, without wasting much time, let's start with a, a sketch or a new path. So control N uh, in order to start with the solid box. So we have to start with control N so that the pop up will become like three modules like part, assembly, and drawing as you all know. So let's start with a new path. In this design, we are going to do customize a lot of things, but uh, yeah, before let's start with the um, uh, top line, and I'm gonna create a circle. And as you know already, like I used to create before, um, and I'm going to uh, say more the models with when I'm start recording, like I would like to do before so that I have some idea of the dimensions how it could be so it's now it's an inch so I will try with the mm okay so we yeah, will start with the mm okay I would like to have around 110 or yeah 100 should be fine my die of that so <coughs> Now I'm gonna create a profile. Yes, and these two entities I will make as a symmetric. Now I will just draw a line to make sure the angle to evenly distributed. So I'm gonna distribute well. Yes, that's what I was looking for now. Yes, perfect. So this one I have to adjust. So what I will do is like I will just make or I can offset by 10 mm. Yes, that makes sense. And I will just make construction line and I will try to make. Yes, perfect. Okay, so this is my uh, profile, one of the profile. So I would like to create another profile where I would like to have a bottom face. Yes, uh, it's around 100 again. Yep, perfect. Yeah, you can customize like your total height like at the end of the video. I will tell you like which are the dimensions we can modify as per our need so that you know we can just play around to create multiple, you know, um, uh, 3d a uh, print floor part or it can be a decorator for your home yep so yes i'm gonna create this and uh, similarly i'm gonna convert entities these two and uh, these two are my construction lines and i'm gonna create another profile here yeah, probably i will create a I will not take an entity because I may change this dimension in future so I would like to have 120 and I will just make this to concentric and this as a concentric I don't want this plane to be visible I'm gonna hide you can if you want hide you can right click and hide uh, maybe an option okay so yeah better <laughs> I'll go here and hide this yes perfect and also and now we are going to do a reverse entity options where yes okay um, I, I don't want to take any reference from that uh, sketch one so I'll hide this for now yes okay that could be an enough and also I would like to take offset again to reverse to make sure these two entities and again this two okay good I don't like to be this profile I don't know maybe some graphic issue or uh, converted from the sketch one might be the reason delete create 12 okay perfect and I will remove this symmetric I mean uh, perpendicular 
circularity and I will create these two lines as a symmetric so that the bottom profile is ready now so uh, we have uh, two profiles where we are going to create a you know a, a, a surface for that again I need some kind of a points where I would like to have uh, you know uh, 3d points so um, probably I used to have these two areas one and uh, maybe from here and to this side and um, okay oops I don't want that to be now created actually yes this line has to go and meet with this and such a way it has to come the other way so that I can mirror so now for, for now again I'm gonna create 3d spreads which I would like to have here let's see based on the surface and points uh, we'll, we'll do that so a uh, loft I would like to have uh, this profile I mean a clear section I will go with the selection manager in order to select this only the entity and uh, select ok so this has to go and meet with this profile yes perfect I mean uh, it's not the profile 2 I would like to have I would like to have the point yes perfect now similarly I just want this to be done here for that again I will go for the loft and go with the selection manager and gonna select this entity and I'm gonna select OK now as you know I'm gonna select the sketch one point so that I have the profile perfect so now these two profiles are ready okay and I'm gonna do a mirror to create another way yes mirror body to be selected these two bodies I would like to have and surface if possible no. then I don't want to be that uh, maybe we can do manually so now we will we'll need to do a circular pattern so what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna tell you the reference to create an axis as you all know this is a top line and I'm gonna select this point to create an axis yes so now uh, what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna do a circular pattern I'm gonna create a circular pattern simple circular patterns I mean like I will delete this I'll select this and the body these are the bodies which I would like to have around 15 bodies so that it will be all perfectly come as a edge that's why we split it into a 12 a degree now I'm, I will hide this so almost our outer profile is ready so now uh, what we can do here is like you go for the surf and uh, need surface to me uh, not to match you can see drag and drop or you can select here control a so all the surface will be get selected then you can go for uh, select ok to you know net the surface yep so now it's become a single uh, surface body before it was like multiple surface body we have so in order to make this as a solid what I'm gonna do here is I'll select this uh, face to create a circle I mean uh, um, it's, a, it's a rough circle which is, has to be offsetted from your profile and also I would like to have at that top hanging in sketch I'm going to do the convert entity yes so these two profile I'm going to create a planar surface yes and this again a planar surface I would like to have so now uh, we have an option called a trim surface so where I would like to have to trim so we can have a standard it's say where we can select only two surface in mutual you can select a multiple surface like you know like three two four, multiple like here 
and which other surface you would like to have to trim so those many surfaces you can select and automatically detect which surface to be removed and which surface has to be keep so in that I have selected remove selection so I would like to remove this I mean yep sorry yes sorry yeah so I would like to remove this and this now it become as a complete enclosed surface here we have an option called create solid you can select this option else you can go for a multi means like thickness and you can add thickness to that so this uh, create solid will help you to create the surface to solid actually so now its surface is done yes perfect now you can go for a shell option where you can create a hollow like I would like to have this surface to be removed and keep my uh, overall solid to maintain a thickness of 2 mm so I'm gonna select ok now so as you can see this our part is ready yeah if you see yes so as simple as and also you can uh, you know create as I said like it's now it's a, it's, it's a straight profile and if you want a little taper like you can go and modify this dimension as I mentioned uh, before I haven't taken any reference from here now I'm going to create a 90 uh, yes or maybe 100 should be have enough uh, taper but yeah we will be having yes as you can see uh, this is a taper which I was trying to say and also you can create a height adjustment like uh, yes instead of 200 yeah you can edit uh, this one by 200 by 100 to 200 so total overall height will be get uh, you know decreased and also you can do for very uh, you know short profile uh, for example uh, 50 i would like to have so even i can have for 50 so this is how it looks uh, so yeah hope uh, you like this video and uh, please uh, feel free to comment in the comment section if you have any clarification or any doubts regarding this or you know in the solid box feel free to ask and uh, yeah uh, that's all for today uh, we'll see you in the next video until then bye from shape thank you